Hey guys, this is Ish at Ish's Tactical Solutions, and today we're going to do a quick review on the ATN uh, Thor. It's their thermal, and this is uh, this is their cheaper version. It's the 360, so 1.5 to 5, I think, and a real small objective. Um, they are kind of pricey, but for thermals would be cheap. And I just wanted to do a quick review on it. I've done review on their day and night binoculars and their day and night uh, uh, smart scope. So I just wanted to do a quick review on their thermal. As for ATN, I have had nothing but problems with their uh, customer service. And now I have to say that I don't know what has happened, but I had a, an issue with losing uh, my eyepiece and the I tell you what I I don't know how or if it's just a different person whatever the the case may be but the customer service was awesome this time so I have to get that out there because I have been bashing ATN over their customer service and now I had a good experience with them so hopefully that continues on um, I love using the thermal thermal is a lot of fun uh, thermal is easy to actually pick up things at night uh, even though trying to actually get its uh, its signature out there is a, a little bit harder, the uh, for me I know uh, I know what's coming up most of the time just because I, of the movement, but uh, I have to wait a while before I can actually say hey you know this is what I see. It has the exact same buttons that the ATN Smart One does. It records uh, whenever you recoil, uh, so it'll uh, start 30 seconds before you shot and 30 seconds after. All right, based off that recoil, and I mean all those same features it has, uh, and of course the recording's the, a lot of fun for us. It does have the hookup for uh, the external battery. You see the pack there; it hooks up into here, and uh, like I said, just uh, GPS, wi Wi-Fi, everything else that we've talked about before. This does, but this one is more expensive. There's a reason for it, and uh, that's because it's thermal. Now, complaint, complaint is. Uh, the 1.5 or 5, none of it's true. So when you go to shoot 100 yards, it seems like it's 150 yards. That is thermal for you, though. Unless you're going to spend $10,000 on thermals, you're always going to have that problem because the pixel rating has got to be so high compared to how far you're, you're zooming up. So uh, for you to get a good signature to understand what you're looking at, all right, it's got to be down. I mean, it's just the the life of thermal. So it's just something to take into account. I find it harder to shoot with a thermal than I do night vision, but I find it so much easier to pick up the the predators or whatever it is that I'm uh, uh, looking at. It's just a little bit harder to uh, well, it's quite a bit harder to identify. And uh, if you're like us, you're you're not going to shoot till you identify exactly what you're shooting at. So uh, with that being said. Um, it, it, it does record very well and it does look good. I have plenty of recordings. I'm going to put a couple of recordings just of animals running around and stuff like that at the very end of this, so check it out. All right. Uh, this is the ATN's thermal uh, or the Thor, and uh, it's their lower setting one. You can, you can spend up, you can get up to that 640 and uh, uh, a higher objective. And look, if you want to be able to, to shoot, Further with the thermal, that's probably ideal. If not, it is nighttime. This right here is probably the cheapest solution you'll get out of thermals that you're going to be able to use. So uh, check out the videos at the end. All right, we'll put a link to uh, ATN on here. Uh, subscribe, make us a favorite. God, family, country, all in order. And thanks for watching. Oh, he's bleeding. I shot him too. Yeah. I was like, hold on, I'm watching him. My cord went out. I'm watching him. How was he running like that? 